Is there something on there? Oh yeah, dude. <gasps> What is going on today, guys? It is super early in the morning. It's only 8 a.m. And today we are back out here to do some more magna fishing. Now, today we're actually at a spot that I have never been to before. It's a great big fishing dock. So we're gonna give this spot a shot here. We're gonna throw the magnet around here a little bit. And if we don't find very much, right on the other side of the river here, there's another fishing dock. Now, I do have the 360 degree magnet with me today, guys. So there is just no telling what we could possibly find. We're not going to waste any time. We're going to get right down to it, start tossing these magnets, and we're going to see if we can find anything here today. If you guys would like to pick up some merch or you want to pick up a magnet, the links will be down in the description, guys. All right, guys, today we are back out here. Once again, we have our 360 degree magnet with us today. And check out this juicy looking fishing dock here. This looks pretty juicy. All right, guys, let's get right down to it, start tossing, and see if we can find anything here today. What is that? Whoa. Oh my goodness, dude. Is there something on there? Oh yeah, dude. <gasps> what the heck is this? Whoa. Dude, what the heck is this, you guys? Look at what I just found. Is that like a a phone stand or some kind of, it's definitely some kind of tripod, but what the heck kind of, kind of deal is this, you guys? I've never seen nothing like that. Two guys, holy smokes. Oh, look right here. It says Primos or Primos hunting trigger stick. And is this like pull the trigger? I don't know what's going on here. There's like a grip on there, dude. That's super cool. This thing's got to be worth some money. Dude, you guys, this is a super cool find. The old Primo's trigger stick. Holy smokes. No way. What a find. What else is in here? See, now, if you look right here, there's tons of apartments and tons of restaurants, tons of businesses. And this is like a back alley, you guys. So I guarantee you there's probably been tons of stuff tossed off of this. Huh, right here, I'm hitting something else again. What the heck is that? Huh? I hit something for a second anyway. Oh, right here, right here. Yep, see all them bubbles coming up? I definitely just grabbed something, guys. Uh, I don't see nothing, <laughs> but I definitely feel something. Yep, what do we got here? What is this one? Um, that one doesn't look like nothing too fancy. Just some kind of bridge bracket or something. Maybe the old dock metal. I thought I saw a little something else on there though. Yeah, this guy right here. I thought it kind of looked like a bullet, but no, check it out you guys. We got us the big old sinker. We'll take that bad boy, add that to the old fishing collection. All right, you guys, nothing too super crazy there. A little bit of cash money for the cart. And we got us the old sinker Rooney. Oh, hold on. See a little something white on there on the bottom. What do we got on here, you guys? Holy scraps, but check this out. What the heck is this? Otherwise, it looks like just tons of scrap, tons of nails. Looks like a lot of super old bottle caps. Look at that, you guys. I see a couple of those in there. There's not even any color left on those. Look at that. But this little thing right here, what the heck you think that one is? Ooh, if you look real close, there's like some numbers on there. Who knows what the heck that is? Is that a bolt in the middle? I can't even tell. Huh, we got the old something something. Ooh, what is that? Oh my, oh my. The heck was that? I just hit something there. I don't know if that was a rock or what the heck that was definitely felt something oh i think we got something here oh here we go 
I got something on here. What is this? What the heck? Is that a stick hanging off of there? That is definitely a stick. Look at all that fishing line tied up in there, guys. Other than that, it doesn't, again, look like a whole lot on there. Tons of scrap. We're getting this scrap almost every throw. But again, you guys, look at, we got one bottle cap two bottle caps these things are super rusted all right you guys again nothing too super crazy on that throw we got a whole bunch of fishing line out of the water so that's good too bad there wasn't no fishing lures tied up in there is that something right there i feel like i got something right here why does that feel heavy it don't look heavy wait a minute dude is this another part of that thing we just caught before yeah it, dude it is no this is getting weird hold on yeah right here look at i could tell right away because of the little the little white piece hanging off of there dude this is like the exact same thing only this one's like you could definitely tell what it is a little bit better. What in the world do you guys think that one is, dude? I've never seen anything like that. Is this maybe like some of the insides of a fishing reel? I have no idea. That is kind of funky looking. Whoa, what's that? Oh, is that a rock? No. What the heck is this? Oh my gosh. I'm like bobbing the dock up and down when I pull. Oh, what the heck was that? I don't, I don't know what that was, dude. The old magnet snagger, probably. Oh, you got something's on here. Oh my gosh, you guys. Bingo. Check it out, dude. Nice. We got us the old pocket knife. This looks like just the old one knifer. Yep, dude. Heck yeah, you guys. Other than this, looks like just a whole bunch of scrap wires on there. Nothing too fancy. Add this one to the old knife collection. I gotta have about 50 to 100 pocket knives. I'm not even kidding. Cash money, baby. Oh, I don't have my rope tied down right now. <laughs> I almost just thought I threw that whole thing in there. Don't do that. Ooh, what's that? Did I just grab something? I think I did. I just flipped something over, you guys. Oh, yeah. Wait, is it still on there? Well, now I don't know. Now it feels like I just grabbed something else. <laughs> what is going on here? Oh, my goodness. What the heck just happened there? Get, get over here. I don't know what the heck's going on down here, guys. Oh, I definitely have something. Oh, show, baby. What do I got here? What the heck is this? Oh, look at a couple things on there. Look at that one, the big old Duracell battery. Check that out, you guys. How long you think that one's been in there? I don't see a year on it. And look at this. What the heck is that? I was almost going to say that kind of looks like a fishing sinker, but there's nothing to uh, attach a fishing line to, so I don't know. That is weird looking. But then we had us this bad boy on there, and again, you guys, it looks like just some dock metal again. Just the old dock bracket, maybe from this thing. Who knows? I'm right, I'm right. What the? Dude, I didn't even think there was anything on there, you guys. Look at this. What the heck? It's whatever this is. It kind of looks like a bracelet that's wrapped up in these nails here. Is that what that is, dude? I think so. Or like maybe an ankle bracelet or something, dude. Yeah, 100%. It's got a little shell on there. That's kind of cool, you guys. Holy cow, the odds of catching that with a magnet are pretty slim. Oh, 
Bingo, you guys. Check that one out. I got to take some Benadryl or something before I come out here next time because holy cow, I cannot stop sneezing. But you guys, check this one out. Look at that spinner. That's a pretty nice one. Ooh, look at what I see on the top of the magnet there. Yup. Look at you guys. We got us another fishing sinker. This one's a tiny one. Heck yeah, you guys. The old cash money fishing lure. Oh, look at what's hanging off the bottom, dude. Bingo. Check that fishing lure out, man. That's a super nice one. And it doesn't even look cracked or nothing, you guys. This one's good to go. Probably replace the hooks on there anyways, but dude, the old Rapala countdown. Oh, heck yeah, baby. We are catching all kinds of fishing lures here today. The old cash money fishing lures. Oh, some stuff hanging off of there. What the heck is going on here, you guys? First of all, what is this one? Huh? This one kind of looks like a super smushed up can. You can kind of see like a little design on there. That sucker is old. We got, of course, a whole bunch of scrap, you guys. That's literally just about every throw. But what the heck is this thing here, you guys? Definitely is rubber. I don't know what in the world that is. Is that maybe like a, just a chunk of a tire? I don't know though, because if you look real close, now I see two nails poked in there. I don't know what the heck that could be. Huh. Oh, what is that? What the heck is that? Oh, it's like the, the, what is that? The bale part off of a fishing reel. All right, you guys. So before we caught us part of what maybe could be part of the fishing reel. And now we caught us part of the fishing, the bale off of the fishing reel. the heck is going on here oh, a little something oh dude first of all what the heck is this is that a sock it sure is you guys what the heck i caught a somebody's sock throw that one in the drawer and again you guys of course tons of scrap tons of nails on there but check it out i see the color under there Ooh. And that's not just the old average jig either. That one's got the dangly on there. Heck yeah, you guys, check that jig out. That one's definitely reusable. Nice, you guys. Oh, wait a minute. What the heck is this? I didn't even think there was anything on there. Dude, I found something just like this before. It, it's like a, you guys can see there's kind of like a lid on there. It's almost like a tiny little tin. Oh yeah, I got it open. What the heck? The other one I had to like pry open with a screwdriver. What the heck is in there anyways? Is that like makeup or what in the world is that wonder if there's a little design on there this thing's got to be so old wonder if that sucker's worth some money cleaned up like a super old makeup brand or something who knows that's kind of cool Ooh, 
what is that? Dude, check it out, you guys. Look at what's hanging off of there. We got the old Spoonerooski. That is crazy, you guys. The amount of silverware that I have found magnet fishing, I could probably make a couple sets. Heck <laughs> yeah, you guys. All right, you guys, we are starting to run out of time here for today, and we still have to take a scrapyard run. Overall, you guys, definitely not too bad of a day. We found tons of fishing lures, and definitely the find of the day is that little tripod thing, the, the gun trigger stand, whatever the heck that is. That thing's definitely got to be worth some money. All right, guys, so I'm sure we'll be back in the future, but we got to take a scrapyard run. All right, guys, we are on our way to the scrapyard right now, and we are going to be taking a scrapyard run.
Holy smokes, you guys, there is a lot of clams in the back of the truck there. I think we only add up a little bit of clams every time, but holy cow, after like five, six scrapyard runs, you guys, that thing is full of clams. All right, guys, if you have not been on a scrapyard run with us yet, the way this works is we go on the scale, we weigh ourselves, which is what we already did. Now we get to go back on the scale again. We get to re-weigh ourselves and we get to see how much money we get for all of our scrap metal. Check it out guys, right here we had 1,120 pounds of scrap metal at eight cents a pound, so we got just under $90. Definitely not too bad at all, you guys. Scrap prices definitely aren't at 11, 12 cents anymore, but at least they're not back down to three and four cents yet. Not bad at all, you guys. 90 bucks is 90 bucks. All right, you guys, so that is gonna wrap our video up here for today. If you guys enjoyed this video, please make sure to hit that thumbs up button for me, and don't forget to subscribe, guys. Make sure to stay tuned, and I will catch you on the next one.